Hey guys and welcome to the Bayern View. Hopefully you guys are all doing well. In this particular video, this is going to be the Bayern Munich versus Augsburg preview. Uh, the plan was actually put it up yesterday, but um, I was too late to do the videos and obviously I had to do the press conference video and then the Ryan Greven Birch uh, Missouri um, video. Um, so I do apologise that this is out late, but either way, welcome to the Buy and View. Hopefully you guys are all doing well. If you go on to enjoy, please smash the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button. Again, this is going to be the Bayern Munich versus Augsburg um, preview. Obviously a Bundesliga game. And realistically, bragging rights in a certain sense because they did beat us uh, at their place um, earlier in the season 2-1. So, um, yeah, thank you for the constant support on the channel. We recently hit 400 subscribers, which is... I know tiny to some people, but for me, it's absolutely amazing. So thank you. Uh, and we're on that road now to hitting that big 1,000. Um, so thank you very much. With that said, uh, like I said, this is going to be the preview. In the last match we played them, they, um, we played um, terribly, realistically. Uh, Lewandowski was the only one to get on the score sheet. If we go to the stats, I'm not going to read too many of them, so don't worry. We had 10 corners and only scored one goal. Um, yeah, I don't know what was going on that day. And then we had 18 shots before on target. Of course, we had um, possession. We had 80%. Um, so I'm really hoping um, that today, I normally say tomorrow, but I'm obviously uploading this late, that today... The lads can can stick it out and actually do something um, and break it down, basically, um, you know, after that horrible, 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 horrible um, defeat to uh, Villarreal in the Champions League, the embarrassing display, I want to see a good performance. Now, don't get it twisted. Augsburg are a very good team, but also they they will sit back. That's what they did in the last one, and they smashed us in the last one. Well, they didn't smash us, but you know what I mean by that. Um, so, um, yeah, with that said, let me quickly just go over to the table. So, Augsburg are currently sitting... Why can I not see them? Uh, currently sitting 13th, 8 wins, 8 wins, 8 draws, uh, 12 losses, 30... Uh, 34 goals for 45 against. So realistically, um, you know, they, they've conceded, well, they have conceded way more than they've scored, um, minus 11. Um, but in the last couple of games, uh, Augsburg, um, they beat, they beat Mainz 2-1, uh, they beat Wolfsburg, um, and then they lost 3-2. Um, to um, Stuttgart. So in the last two games, they're in very, very good form. Um, again, I'm not going to sit here and, and talk like I've watched them because I haven't, but uh, I just know what, what's happening. Obviously, we're sitting at the top of the league at the moment, um, but we do need a big performance from that uh, performance the other night. That was shocking. Um, but yeah, my lineup, I would go with Neuer in goal. Um, right back, I'd go with Pavard, two centre-backs, um will be Nicolas Sula will play because I know that um he wants to Nagelsmann wants to rest um wants to rest let me do the brightness there we go uh wants to rest uh Lucas Hernandez for the Champions League game so Nicolas Sula will play uh he'll probably play with, with Mancano but I would actually I wouldn't mind um Tenga Enzu getting some game time to be to be perfectly honest. Uh, and then left back won't be Davies. I think he's going to rest him also. So we'll probably play um, Omar Richards. Uh, I hope that he doesn't play Hernandez left back. Because if you're going to give him a rest. Please just give both of them a rest. For me personally. I wouldn't give Fonzie a rest. Um, you know. I know that he was out with a heart issue and so on. But realistically he shouldn't have played the 90 minutes. If he's not ready to come back. So he obviously is ready. Um, and you know. They're not the best team. So giving, giving them that, that challenge of stopping Fonzie. Um, you know, this isn't a Villarreal that's going to attack you like um, Augsburg will. Villarreal are a way better team. So, um, I think it's a mistake if we don't play Fonzie, but we'll see. We'll see what happens with that. Um, but probably Omar Richards in the midfield. Uh, Goretzka will play um, because uh, he's come out and said that he he needs minutes, which he does need minutes. Um, who else? Um, Kimmich. Kimmich will obviously come in. Uh, and then it will probably be um, Nabry. 
Coleman and Muller and then uh, Lewandowski up top. Chipper Moting uh, had COVID but is now testing, uh, not testing positive, testing negative for it. But he's got something to do with his knee, like a bruise under the kneecap or something, which sounds hella painful. Um, but yeah, that's going to be the lineup. Let me know what you think in the conversation down below. Score prediction. I want 5-0. I want 5-0. Um, but they did roll us over in the last one. Uh, and with the Bayern team that showed up the other night, I'm hoping we don't get the spineless Bayern team because I don't want to see that. I generally don't want to see that. So for me, uh, I'm going to go with a 3-1 win. I'm hoping for a clean sheet. For noise sake, I'm hoping for a clean sheet. Uh, and um, I, I just want a good win. To be perfectly honest with you, a good performance, a good win, just to push on going into Tuesday with some good momentum to to smash them um simple as that um obviously this is a big game it's the bundesliga game obviously we're still pushing for that 10th 10th uh, title in a row um so yeah there's that but yeah i'm going with a free one hopefully it'll be a free nil though but that's going to be it for the video let me know what you think of my lineup let me know you think of your uh score prediction what you think of my score prediction let me know again thank you for the constant support on the channel uh and uh until then that's going to be it there'll be pr probably um no other video until the stream uh, and then obviously the live stream will happen and then there'll be a match reaction and um Nagelsmann's press conference and we'll go from there there might be news about um Ryan Govan Birch we'll have to wait and see but that's gonna be it for the video hopefully you guys are all doing well if you have enjoyed please do smash the thumbs up hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already again thank you for 400 that's absolutely insane generally thank you uh, and until then I'll see you guys in the next one till then Mia Samia peace out Come on, Bayern. Today's the day. Let's go.